more legs for you, and now no arms. <laughs> All right, I don't even want to waste any more rockets on that guy when bullets will totally do the trick. I'll use what's left in the clip, though, even though I'm this far away before I reload, because, you know, reloading reloads both, so might as well. Yeah, there we are. Jeez, now that was a lot of enemies. After that first wave, it was a lot. That was a lot. Gosh. Alright, let's go picking up stuff, shall we? Thought I saw some stuff laying around over here. Maybe I was mistaken. It's probably all these little lights just everywhere. We'll take this opportunity to use a little bit more health. I got one more little health pack left. And then five mediums. And ammo is precariously low. Okay, got it. Bench required soon. Understood. Really, with those things, I should just be uh, tearing the limbs off of these guys, but it's not nearly as much fun as shooting them. Not gonna lie. <laughs> Alright. Back to this odd puzzle. So that goes to there and there, and it doesn't go over there. I can't reach that far. Okay. Well, I think I'm done being randomly waylaid by monsters now. I can probably actually figure the puzzle out. Hmm. So that does nobody any good. So they need like-sided, uh... prongs. Similar prongs to make energy connections, huh? So that doesn't even have the right kind for that one. At all. <laughs> if it's gonna be connected to the middle one. Unless maybe I spin this one around? What? Maybe work? I don't... Let's give that a shot. So you go one more big giant middle statue. Okay. Yeah, that does that. And so there's one more to switch. Yeah, that one. Okay. Is there a bench nearby after this? <laughs> I sure hope. It would not be unappreciated. Alright, I, I switched a bunch of stuff. You cool now? Alright, just got the power line. Looks like it opened another activation terminal. We're getting closer to fixing this machine, Carver. Cool. Carver is obviously very excited. This is another one of those things where I'm not entirely 100% certain that we are 100% entirely certain what we're doing and what the effects will be, for that matter. It's another one of those, like, oh no, we accidentally unfroze the moon ourselves because we're stupid. Like, there have been enough of those moments already that I'm just not... not confident. Isaac, what are you doing? Finishing something that should have been done a long time ago. Well, stop it! You're tampering with things you know nothing about. I know just I enough. You, jackass. <laughs> yeah, no shit. Ha! <laughs> I was gonna say I know just enough to be thoroughly, thoroughly dangerous. You know, what's that saying? A smattering of knowledge is more dangerous than no knowledge at all. You know, if you know just enough about how to make a bomb, you're probably gonna blow yourself up. As opposed to actually being knowledgeable about the subject. And that's just a random example there. Something that would be dangerous to fiddle with. I suppose working on uh, nuclear technology would be in the same category. I guess we're uh, I guess we're going out of here the way we came. Thoroughly. On that note, there's probably a bench down here, so let's get to it. How's the ammo looking in this? Eh, pretty solid. Not reloading with two rockets in the thing. Especially not when ammo is a little scarce at the moment. 
Let's see, it said down was where I needed to go to put a, uh... Yep, right here. Good. I did remember. I didn't entirely forget. It wasn't until I was going down that I remembered, but, you know, same difference. The point is the thing is placed. Hello, large alien head. Shiny. Well, you've successfully turned the city into a giant pretzel. Now what? If Serrano's right, I should be able to return to the first activation point to enter the final setting. What happens then? Hey, I work on spaceships, Not you? alien machines, right. <laughs> Fair enough. Yeah, exactly. Like, we're really not entirely sure what we're doing and what's gonna happen. We're fiddling. It seems thoroughly, thoroughly dangerous to me to fiddle with a thing like this. What are our, what are the options, really? What are our options? You know, it's like, don't fiddle. And everything maybe is uh, the end of all things, you know? And uh, if we do fiddle, then uh, everything is maybe the end of all things. I don't know. It's damned if we do, damned if we don't, kind of. I can't go down anymore, so that better be close enough. I had a bad feeling like maybe I actually had to hit the glowy spot where I was going to sail over it and crash into the wall. And I was like, okay, look, I'm holding down. Come on, game. Cut me some slack. Besides, building tension, you know, you want me to not encounter any enemies for a while, right, game? Come on. Build tension for a little while. Give me a break. Of course, we reloaded between the last time we were through here and now, so... A respawning of items is not terribly un uh, in ordinary. What is that? How come I can't pick that up? Weird. I was close enough, you would have thought, but no, I had to TK it. And, like, another thing you can do when you reload is suddenly be able to drop those things again. I heard noise. The music. I just expected something to be jumping me. Made me nervous. Let's let's run, shall we? <laughs> Alright, we're going that way. Yeah, cool. Go little scavenger bot. Yeah, this is the way we came in. Oh, cool. That's why I turn around, because you never know what you might see. Yep, that is my recollection. I'm glad we don't have to reactivate all these doors on the way back through. This isn't the way, Isaac. There is a future for you, for all of us. Leave me alone, Danik. You can see them again, Isaac. Everyone you've lost along the way. Oh, you're full of shit, Danik. No regrets. I have no regrets, Danik. One way or another, this will all be over soon. Isaac! <laughs> Suddenly, Danik's the one who's, like, desperate to plead his case, and it's like, oh, you are, uh, not really doing a good job of it. You're still making vague promises to which you have no evidence whatsoever, not even square one of evidence to uh, support your claims. So, yeah. Like, I don't need the whole enchilada, I just need a tiny, tiny shred of a reason to follow your line of thinking. Give me one tiny, tangible fact that supports your case, and I'll, inter I'll be interested. But I haven't even heard one tiny shred of a reason to think that the nightmare that is the necromorph uh, infection. Whoa, oh god! Holy crap. Oh, I'm right next to him. I'm next to him when I shot a rocket. I didn't expect to suddenly be waylaid by those guys. Holy crap! Okay, um, might as well start with this equip now. Ha. <laughs> ha. 
Am I supposed to use super TK on those guys? Maybe super stasis. That might be a thing to consider. We'll just run back to the stas that thing and super stasis the crap out of them. Oh my gosh, how many does it take? Oh, I'm still too close. Crap, 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 crap. Oh, there's more of them. Oh, not what I wanted to do. All right, reload quickly, Isaac. Oh, I didn't mean to double, triple. Triple stasis! Activate! Oh, I didn't mean to roll forward of all directions. Oh my gosh! How many- are these just infinite until I run through here? Is that what I'm dealing with here? Oh crap! I am out of health. Oh, they're not done yet. Regular stasis really works pretty well, honestly. I hear this guy stomping around. Wow. I'm fine. Everything's fine. I have lots of health. What are you talking about? Yeah. Cool. Alright. Well, they're not infinite. Uh, <laughs> I was really, really worried I was going to die several times during that whole exchange. <laughs> I don't care if it's super inefficient to reload a little bit. I, I want full weapons. <laughs> Jeez, they're really throwing the, the heavy hitters at us now, aren't they? Super stasis isn't that super. Like, it might slow them down extra, but the duration is not all that much more. And they already slow down so much that it, it hardly makes any difference. So, yeah, at least that's my assessment of the super stasis. Well, yeah, bench would be totally awesome. Anytime the game wants to give us that. Or, you know, we can fly around some more. That's cool, too. See, it says there's a bench over here. Let's, uh... Let's take a little side detour here. <laughs> it veers off to the right before going left. Ah, there's the bench. Cool. Welcome back, scavenger bot. I'm about to turn that all into ammo. And uh, while we're on that note, let's see, rate of fire, I think, yeah. That way those line rounds fire off a little bit quicker. And we don't really have anything in our safe to speak of. That's okay, we have stuff. <laughs> We've really got enough stasis packs. We really have enough stasis packs. We'll keep one in the safe. Cool. Items acquired. At least, you know, Enough to feel a little bit better about it. <laughs> like, well, he just runs through those big giant corpses. Just out of the way, coming through. Over here? Yay. Cool. 
suddenly feeling the pinch on supplies. <laughs> Felt like that would be prudent. And right, now we're back to going for the objective, which happens to be the same way. Convenient. Very convenient indeed. Yeah, that'd be an awesome front door, wouldn't it? I guess we're we're probably going in. I'm using one. I probably should have crafted a few more, but meh. Hindsight's twenty twenty, right? That looks like a thing. Or is it just the energy field? Yeah, just looks like the energy field now. <laughs> it really throws you at the ground. Holy crap. Oh, hey, it's it's these assholes again. How many rockets does it take to kill you? Oh, what's happening? Where am I? Oh, I backed into the thing. Oh, later guys. I guess I'll be back in a minute. I guess I'll take this opportunity to reload. <laughs> that was weird. I shot that guy with a lot of rockets and nothing really happened. Go down, Isaac. Kind of odd and pointless this whole trip. Okay, back across now. I guess if you don't get out of the thing, you uh, maybe can't do damage to him. Maybe I wasted all those rockets. Maybe that's what happened. Let's get ready with the big guns right off the bat here. We there's really not that much to avoid here in this sequence. All right, here we go again. This time, staying down on the ramp. And suddenly it's dead quiet. Nice. Not a sign of anything. Neat. It still looks like something I should be able to get. I know it's just a light. They're annoying. <laughs> well, I mean, they're giving us a bench. We might as well craft some stuff. <laughs> I feel like you, I should never pass these up. I don't even know what those ration seals are for. Not the slightest idea. Cool. Right, let's head up top. I guess that's where we're going? Yeah, blue line says up. 14 rounds in the rifle. All 10 in the shotgun. That's cool. I'm surprised those unitologists down there were the only guys I've run into here. Like, I flew away and came back. I guess that maybe confused them. Alright, so we need to make the inner two intertwine and the outer two just kind of stand up. Alright, well, let's... Just start at one side here. Is that the right way? It like bows out and then comes in, kinda? Uh, let's just say that's cool. Oh yeah, there you go. Well, that did a thing again. Let's fire the son of a gun off. <laughs> I have like no idea what to expect from this. Well, I hope what we just did is good. I guess we'll find out next time. I kind of like our weapon combos. I know I've been using the shotgun and assault rifle for the whole game, but it's awesome. Thank you so much for watching. Do like it if you liked it, and I will catch you next time. Peace.